Good evening and welcome to the Business Day. I am Vashon Brown. Gas prices are going down tomorrow. A litre of 87 and 90 gasoline will cost $2.36 less. Now the price of automotive diesel is down $1.84, while ultra-low sulfur diesel is costing $3 less. $3.06 is being slashed. $3.06 is being slashed from the price of kerosene and propane. Butane is going for $2.88 less. Oil prices traded higher today. Oil for delivery in August gained 55 cents to settle at $39.82 per barrel. NCB has announced plans to streamline its insurance business currently offered by its competing subsidiaries NCB Insurance Company and The Guardian Life. Now, Group President and CEO Patrick Hilton says while each entity has delivered strong results, having competing entities within the same group of companies has resulted in missed opportunities. NCB Insurance Company is seeking approval from the Financial Services Commission to transfer 100% of the company's portfolio of insurance and, annu and annuities business to Guardian Life. If approved, NCBIC will discontinue its business as an insurance underwriter. Now, however, the company will retain and continue to operate its business as a pension fund administrator and investment manager. NCB Insurance will sell insurance products as an exclusive agent of Guardian Life under a new company name. The company says insurance policies for existing policyholders will not be impacted as Guardian Life will honor the contracts being transferred on its current terms. Epley Caribbean Property Fund conducted a share buyback of 10,284 of its shares last month. Now the company says the transaction was done to unlock shareholder value by purchasing at a price that is at a significant discount to its book value per share. Epley says the source of funding was cash on its balance sheet. Currency trading ended today with the US dollar selling for $139.00. 50 cents. The Canadian dollar closed at $104.56. The pound is going for $179.16, while the euro sold for $160.95. The JC index lost 1,541 points today, while the junior market index gained 245 points. Among the winners were Mayberry Jamaican Equities, Siboney Group, Derman Trading, Pulse Investments, and JMMB Group, 6% US dollar shares. On the losing side were Jetcon Corporation, Elite Diagnostic, Margaritaville Turk, US dollar shares, Fosrich, and SSL Venture Capital. And that's the Business Day. I'm Vashon Brown. Have a good evening.